footing looks like. And as you see, it is, look, do you see that? Watch it wiggle, see it jiggle, cool and fruity, banana pudding. <laughs> I also have this one, which is a smaller serving, which is clearly for Christopher and not myself. But as you see where I took a little off the top. Hey, hey, who is that? Sierra, hey there, friend. So um, what I want to tell you is in that is th um, basically three ingredients. And you could have got away with two and you could sub one out. And, and I want to tell you what's on that in just a minute. But first of all, what have y'all been doing? I've been doing a... um. A group thing going on on uh, with my work where I've been having a group of people and we've been doing the raw reset and so first I did five weeks and now I'm four weeks on that but I'm coming on the weekend too you see and so y'all people are really making gains and health gains and mental <sighs> jumping over their stumbling blocks once and for all to get to the best version of their self and it is exciting people are really doing this thing do you understand that you could take today and be the best version of you you don't have to wait on till till you lose your x amount of pounds or till somebody tells you it's a good time or somebody tells you you're good enough or gives you permission or tells you it's okay for you to get on facebook live and and take any any hurtling comments people say to you and like don't be offended today's the day today's the day to improve yourself you know what i'm saying so um hey megan how are you who is that? The light's behind the phone. Bessie, hey. So let me show y'all this. So what we have is this banana pudding. And as you see, I, I want to show you, um, I want to show you the consistency. Do y'all see that? Now it's going to, do y'all see? Now I'm letting this congeal a little bit in the fridge. I want to tell you what it tastes like. Mmm. Baby, let me love you down. There's so many ways to love you. Banana pudding, I can break it down. <laughs> Everything's not a song unless you come live from the kitchen of love and light. Bam! So, I want to just tell you what was in that. First of all, this is my new favorite additive ingredient to things. And it is called lacuma powder. L-U-C-U-M-A, okay? Hey, Alan. Hey, Zoe. Um, and what this is, it is a dried fruit from Peru that is dried, dehydrated at low temperatures, still raw, and it is a great low glycemic sweetener and, get this, thickener, okay? I have used this several times recently in a lot of my um, dressings, soups, and sauces, and really... It really thickens things up, y'all, and it gives a nice sweetness, and it it is even good for diabetics and anything else, and um, anybody else, and, and not that diabetics can't eat fruit. The thing is, though, when you're having fruit and fat together, that's not good if you have that problem, but that's another talk now, isn't it, for another day? So anyway, what I want to tell you about this is about one tablespoon equals the sweetness of, let's say, about... Uh, two dates okay but it also is a better thickener than that so in this recipe I had uh, three ripe bananas and th these don't look that ripe because they're not that spotty but they really are which let me just say something about that you know a banana could be all spotty and around here in South Carolina where clearly the banana trees don't grow I've never seen one I've, I've lived here all my dang life so anyway when they come here, they're clearly shipped green. I'm convinced of this because bananas now, they have no taste. They taste like cardboard. But still, we don't want to eat them when they're not ready because there's a constipation factor, and that's not good. It doesn't deliver you the, the sugary, get your energy on hit, you know, get your dance on the dance floor hit. So anyway, but when they look like this, sometimes they're ready even though they're not spotty, and these were ready, trust me. And so I took three of those. I peeled them, cut broke them in half, tossed them into the blender. You don't even need a high-speed blender for this. Then, <clears throat> I had one-fourth cup of water, <coughs> and I had three tablespoons of lacuma powder. So let's just say one tablespoon lacuma to one banana, right? So uh, then I had one-fourth 
teaspoon. I understand how small that is. Y'all know the difference in a tablespoon and teaspoon because I was never really a cook before. You know, I was tanny raw. And so, um, this is what it looks like. Like, it, it's not It's not even, It's a, say, this is how small it is. Like, it. it's good for a nostril cover. Very small. So, anyway, one-fourth teaspoon of raw vanilla bean powder. This is some magical stuff right here. This came from the rawfoodworld.com, which is the biggest raw food superstore in the world, Matt Monarch's site. So, bam, there you go, Matt. But um, I really like this. It lasts a long time. It's kind of pricey, but if you watch for a sale, you can get it for a sale. And he always has a coupon. I think it's Raw Food 7 where you can get free shipping and such and sometimes more than that. And I always stock up on these kind of things when they're on sale. Um, also, what we have was one fourth teaspoon of that. I blended that up. I poured it into my little my little cups, and isn't this cute? And I chilled it, and it went in at about um, I don't know about an hour ago, and it just gave it. What you're doing, really, you could have eaten it right then, but you're giving it time for that lacuma powder to thicken, because even I had a, a dip the other day, and I think it was called like. Um, uh, raw vegan dinner party dips uh, OMG dip slash dressing y'all should check that out because that dip had the the consistency of like um, old school French onion dip and the flavor was say my name is what it was I don't even know how else to say it so anyway um so I wanted to tell you that I want to tell you how it tastes and I just wanted to tell you to get your banana pudding on. And have you ever looked up a recipe? For, I've never made banana pudding. But if you ever looked up, it's got condensed milk, all this sugar, packaged pudding, chemicals. It's not a food. It's a toy. It's a recreational activity, friends, of destruction, right? And this is a food to nourish your body, right? Real food. Live food for a live body. Y'all, it... It's ridiculous is what it is. And and while you're in here, you can enjoy. I don't know if you're going to be able to see the majesty of this, but if you can't, I'm sorry because let me just put on my goodies. And, well, I might need to show that again. But this is my cabinet right here of love and light. Can y'all see that? And you can see these are your quart size jars where we have, for example, raw. Let me get the light on, okay? We have raw coconut flakes. We have um, wheat grass powder, uh, barley grass powder. These are raw hulled hemp seed hearts, lacuna, chia seeds. Um, let's see what else. This is some Irish moss that is great for skin. It's great for thickening smoothies, making desserts and such. Okay, these are quart size. These are also BPA free um, lids. And these are uh, labels that disintegrate water, which is kind of nice. Then you've got your pint size, and we've got some raw flax seeds right there. And these, these are your half pints, okay? For example, we've got some paprika. We have got some spirulina. Can you, I hope y'all can see that. And then we have some mustard. You see my point? The point is, that you have entered the land of love and light, right? Did you have any questions? Did you have anything you want to talk about? And should I review the recipe? So again, we had three bananas, right? And then we had, uh, see, I can't really talk to you while this cabinet is open because, you know, I have a disorder like that. So uh, we had three bananas, right? Peeled, they weren't even frozen, okay? Then we had uh, three tablespoons of lacuma powder. Again, a low glycemic raw dried fruit dehydrated down and ground low glycemic sweetener slash thickener. Are you hearing what I'm saying? Thickener. It's a big deal. Okay. And then we had one fourth teaspoon of vanilla bean powder. Okay. You could probably use extract, but I don't. Uh, it's hard to find that around here that's not like an alcohol-based um, toxic toy that's not real food. You know, I want to eat real food, live food for a live body, right? You see what I'm saying? Are y'all picking up what I'm laying down? So you blend that up, and then you pour. My friends want to call when I am clearly connecting with other people of love and light. Do they not know? Do y'all still see me on? Who else is here? Hey, Stacy. Yvonne. Hey. Hey, Laurie. Hey, Shay. Shay's in the house. Hey, Shay. 
Sherry. Hey, Sherry, what you doing? Oh, hi. We say hey. That means hi. Hey, Stacy, how are you? Hey, girl. Who else is on? Okay, so anyway, as I have been yapping about this, again, three ripe bananas, three tablespoons lacuma powder, a dried fruit from Peru that is a low glycemic thickener situation. Okay, I have it in a lot of soup sauces and dressings. And then we have one fourth cup of water and one fourth teaspoon of vanilla bean powder. You blend that up and then you put it in your little fridge. And I put that in there about an hour and it's set up and now I am clearly enjoying a taste test with y'all. Y'all, this is something that gives you an immediate energy hit. And I'll tell you what else, it's easy to digest, okay? Open up. Oh my gosh, like, do y'all, can, do y'all see? Like, is that not? We can have it our way, do you know what I mean? We can have sweet, we can have savory, we can have something more substantial by a cracker. I, I have cookies, I have a whole dehydrator playlist, friends, with like 56 recipes on there. I have been yapping about low-fat raw vegan, or frankly, high raw. If, if you don't want to be raw, okay, you do you and I'll be me. And we'll be free. And I love you just the way you are. Over on Tanny TV, we talk about other things. We talk about setting up boundaries. We thought, talk about manifesting the new love and passion in your life. Getting to the next best version of yourself. And I don't care if it's that you just cut down to half a bottle of Jack Daniels last night instead of a, a whole bottle. I'm with you. I'm cheerleading you. I'm your girl, okay? So you should join me over there. If you can't plug your own channel on on your Facebook, what the heck can you do on there, right? <laughs> ah, hey Cheryl, what are you doing? Do you have anything else you would like to talk about? Do you have any questions or do you have any um any thoughts? Would you like to rebound it? I can't rebound with because well I could put you down and change shirts. Let me tell you something about the rebounder, okay? Do y'all rebound? Y'all, this is I feel, I'm not kidding, in the last 10 minutes I've been yapping about this, I feel an energy hit from this. It's so good. Do y'all have anything else y'all want to talk about? The nearer your destination, the more you subside in a way. It's banana pudding. He came from my hometown. He wore his passion for his woman like a thorn. Say my crown. name. He said the Lord.